I also got ladies and Bruce's up over six killer. Welcome back to Underhero. It is time for us to move deeper into the volcano. We've got what was it called again? The brewing chambers. Sounds pretty intimidating. Let's head on into the brewing chamber. See what happens in there. At least you know we're a save point and healy point, huh? And we got a whole bunch oh shit. We got a whole bu oh god. Oh god, oh god. We got a whole bunch of health potions and stuff as well. So that should make things a bit easier. Oh, not the monkey. I hate the monkey, he's an asshole. Ow. Fuck you, man. Have a fucking laugh at me, you fucking bastard. Enjoy. Are you pissed off yet? Oh fuck! I have to repair my shield! God! I didn't realise. My shield is not repaired. I should not have taunted the monkey without very much taunted the monkey. That sounds like a euphemism for wanking. <laughs> I shouldn't have taunted the monkey without preparing myself. <laughs> it does sound like a euphemism for wanking though. Oh god. Just gonna hang out down here while the uh, Mars goes by. The mini mini Marses. Silly fucking things. Alright, let's roll. I think we're pretty safe from them to be honest. They're not super clever. As far as planets go, you know. Oh, what's down here? Interesting. Seek oh no, not you. No! Have money. Go away. <laughs> Go away. Thank you. I don't want to talk to you. Just go away. Dick bag. All right, I'll talk to you. Good amigo. Lead lending me money. I'll never forget this. You're welcome. I mean, we were one of them. You know, I feel. I should feel bad. I don't feel bad, but I should feel bad that I'm killing them. See, I'm a monster too, you know? I'm one of them. And yet I just start murdering them. My own kind. Because some fucking hilt that I picked up told me to. I feel like the hilt's the bad guy. Uh, okay. Oh, what's that way? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. There's much exploring to be done, amigo. I don't know which way to explore first, because I don't know which way is the way we're meant to be going. This seems pretty major though. It is not though, it is just a treasure chest. Glad I went that way first. Ooh, we're nearly get, nearly at 100 HP. And we basically have never taken HP as a level up reward. I don't think we've taken it once. We might have taken it once, but... It's been very minimal, mainly attack boosting and stamina boosting. Ow! Not burn! Fuck. That's alright, I bought a bunch of water for that, just in case. Eight, in fact. Shit! Bastard! Are you serious? I hate these bats! Wankers! Okay. Put one of these up his butt. Another one up his butt. Summons a shield. Ow! He sucks health out of me like a wanker. Alright, alright. Alright, we good. Take him out! Oh my god. Ha! Shot! In your transition, you got messed up. Ooh. Free money. Ow. Okay, I don't want to go that way just yet. There's obviously something over here. No! Fuck you then, I'm leaving. 
I don't like those guys, they just take too long to fight. That's my problem with them. Too long. That one took me like 50 years to beat. The bats are annoying, but at least they don't take forever. Those guys, I feel like I'd be like a hundred years old before I'm fucking done. God damn it. Bad bad. Alright, finish him. Now let's go. Keep going, keep going. Oh, too far. Ah, fuck. Ah, okay, I can't go that way anyway. Good to know. Hi. Can I help you? Anything I can do to make you stop doing that? I can't throw money at this one, so I guess I have to kill it properly. I guess throwing money at it, it's not going to stop it shooting lava out of its head. Or eating it. Whatever it's doing, I don't know whether it's coming out or going. It looks like it's coming out. That would be why, if you kill it, it the, the lava goes away. Dude, hurry up! Attack me! God damn. Take your time about it, shithead. No oh, balls. Ow! Ow! I hate this guy. Die, you bastard. Oh dear. He's always nasty when he's in this mode. Right, I'm ready. Change forms, I kill you! Yes. Thank you. Level up! Should we just keep buffing damage? I think we'll just keep buffing damage for now. We got a boss coming up. Can't be too far away now. Open this. No, oh, really? That's it? Burn heal? Oh, I'll take it. Ooh, another one. Money! It's only slightly helpful at this point, really. Oh, I see. You can't get back that way. You have to go round. Did not notice that. Alright, here we go. Next area. Oh, this looks a bit like a boss arena. We're heading towards a boss arena. Oh shit! That was not good. <gasps> ah, stop. Fuck! I still hate how you have to like hold up and down to grab onto these. It's so weird! I've never played a game where you have to grab, go up or down to grab the thing before. Even in real old games. Like Earthworm Jim or something. Where does this go? Oh cool, it's a shortcut back to the Healy and Savy station. I guess that means it's a boss now. I'm assuming. I love the Dark Souls-esque shortcuts. Love that very much. Here we go. Oh god. Oh, you're the ones that have been enslaved. 
making salsa. Hey you! Where do you think you're going? Oh, uh, we're here because Mr. Stitch has sent us, yeah. To deliver a very important message. To El Salsarissimo. Ugh. Lord Stitch, as you say. Don Salsarissimo will be very pleased to receive this message. Cool, now let us through. Good luck. Sucker. Why sucker? What the fuck did I do? Okay. Don't know what that was about. Just exploring. Just exploring. Here we go. Oh my god, he's huge. I only talk to those who offer me spicy gifts. What? What the fuck do you want me to do now? Dipshit. I've got some peppers. Does that count as a spicy gift? It. What do you want me to do now then? Looks like they prefer a final product here. I wonder who consumes this stuff. That dipshit over there. He wouldn't listen, right? You need a present to present a proper tribute if you wish to speak to the Don. Should have seen that one coming. He's particularly fond of my salsa. Spicy, but not too spicy if you catch my drift. Okay. Talk to me again if you'd like to cook something for Don, Don Salsarissimo. Fucking let's do it then. You will need to climb that rope there, and you must drop five peppers inside the salsa pot down there. Choosing the right ingredients is the way to go. Don't make it too spicy. He does not like that. Doesn't like it too spicy, eh? Well, I know what to cook. There's gotta be someone here who knows which peppers are the spiciest. You're getting us out of here, right? We'll try to help. Ask the rest of the villagers what salsa is the most favorite salsa recipe. Don't know what you mean. We're counting on you. The spiciest salsa requires at least one king pepper. The nosiest one. The Don hates it when it's too spicy. So don't use the king one? Are oh, you helping us out of here? Shh! Oh, oh, right. If you want to surprise Don, drop one Nocturne Pepper. The purple ones. Okay. Oh shit, I didn't hear that. What'd you say? If what you want is to make something good, add one red pepper. One Nocturne Pepper, one red pepper. You didn't hear this from me. Is that it? Did that go in? I think it did. That's it! I'm done! Am I not done? Do the rest not matter? Oh, what about you? Two tear peppers. The blue ones. Okay. I didn't see you. Sorry. It says it like it, it's speeding up like it's like uh like we're on a time limit or something, but I don't think we are. Honestly, I don't think we are. It feels like we are, because of the high speed music and everything. There's one. Here's another one. Nearly hit the Nocturne one. Alright, cross your fingers. I don't know whether the King Pepper was a good idea or not. You're done. Take it to the Don. Good luck. Insanely hot. Beware. How does he not like it too spicy? He lives in a fucking volcano. What is this? Smells Rico. <clears throat> yes, it's very yummy. Uh-oh. Now we're in trouble. 
Maybe not? I don't know. I think we're in trouble. That was Sol Serissimo, right? You cockroaches, you have burned my sexy tongue! Ha! Remember me, fool? Liza? What in the world are you doing here with this cute mas masquerita? I'm here with this kid to kick your gigantic butt. Grossera, Espada, Inmunda, Stitcher sent us to give you this stone. Ahem. <clears throat> Alright. We are also going to save those coconut heads. You will not release my cheap workforce. I like how he's got a moustache. Ha, yeah we will. Ay, my madre, I will crush you! Disgrace your thuddles. Alright, what do we do? Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Ow. Ow. He hit me twice. I don't know how to deal with him. There's peppers up there. Oh god! There's peppers up there, how do I get to the peppers? No, that's not the way up. What's he doing? Pretty sure that stuff's coming out of his nose though. It's pretty gross. It must be way up on this side then. Ow. No, there's no way up. But I see those things scrolling across the top. Including potions. Health. Yes! Where is he? Oh, he's over there. What's he doing? He's just relaxing. Go back up. Ow. Do I have to grab them while they're down there or what? I don't know what I'm doing. Clearly. I don't think I've hurt him at all. I guess we gotta wait for these ropes again. We just gotta survive until the ropes come. I'll just stand here then. Do my little dance. As long as I keep moving, he can't get me. Here we go. Look, he's having a like a dance and shit. I don't know whether I mean to like bomb him like that or that hurt him. That definitely hurt him. Do I need to like hit him or something? I can go inside him. What the absolute fuck is going on, man? You need to explain your uh, mechanics a little bit further, I think. So we got a time limit. Mechanics not explained well enough, I don't think. Do 
but you know we get there. Fuck. Time limit. As soon as there's a time limit, I fuck it up because I stress out about the time limit. Does this thing fight back? I hope not. Hit him again. Nice. All right, now we know how to beat him. He's gonna shoot me out of his nose, isn't he? Yeah. Alright, let's move. Incoming fire. We want to stick to the left though, so we'll just wait here. Stick to the left hand side so we can grab that rope early. Oh, he's gonna do the scissor hand thing. Oh my god, the lava level's changing now. That was a new move. Where did that come from? The lava level keeps changing and it's really, really weird. Uh oh. Nah, yeah, go away! Ow. I burnt my butt. Are you happy now? Shithead? Maybe burn my butt. Alright, here we go. <laughs> he's kind of adorable, you know. For a boss guy, he's kind of adorable. Open your mouth, dude. Incoming. In we go. See, now we know. Now we know how to do it. Now we just run up to this his internal organy thing and just womp it. Whoa! Hold up, kiddo. Oh god. Oh no, dude. You're way too late this time. <clears throat> We're literally in the belly of the monster. Oh no! The shareholders will not be happy about this. I guess I have to come back later. La lads and lasses? I can offer you a hint as an apology. Make it quick. You should be hasty. Sooner or later this monster will wake up and toss you out like pistachio shells. Okay, we knew that already. Anything else? This monster's guts are in constant movement every time you enter. The position of the weak spot will change. Oh, uh... It's about to change. Good luck, and see you soon, kiddo. Alright. Do those little fires on the ground hurt me? No, they do not. Now we know. We just gotta get there as fast as possible. Shit, I don't know. There's two different paths to take. We got a time limit. We don't have time to, like, second guess ourselves. Fuck! That's going to reduce the amount of damage we can pull off all up. Alright, we're going to head this way. Cross your fingers. Nearly out of time. Oh, fuck, we did it again. Two wrong fucking turns at the, in the same one. And I guess it's going to get more and more confusing as time goes. I guess we can only go until we run out of stamina anyway. I really should buff up my stamina more. So I can land more hits first. Oh my god, we're nearly out of time. One, two, three. Okay, we got three hits on him. Not bad considering the massive fuck up to get here. Alright, bring it on, shithead. What else you got? Ow. So you can't stand on it for too long or it actually falls into the into the lava eventually. Oh, that hit me! Hey! How did that fucking hit me? That wasn't fair. Not cool, bro. No, not again. Oh, yeah. Now we're talking. Ah, delicioso. Oh, 
Let's do it again. Oh shit. That's oh, this water. Good. Oh, it's these things. Dude, inside you? You have these things inside you? That doesn't seem very healthy. Oh my god, we're never gonna find this weak spot now. It's too confusing. At least we can move quickly though. We can cover a lot of ground quite fast. He's a big monster, man. Come on, please be over here. Shot! Hammer time! Oh! Done. Say goodnight, Salsarissimo. Now I can actually say his name. But it's too late, he's dead. I'll see you later. Have a beautiful time. Ow. God damn it. That ruined the moment. Are you gonna finish dying soon? Or are you just gonna die here forever? Music changed to sad music, why? Okay, well we beat him again. Unfortunately there was no way before to get out of it except to kill myself. Which I did. Last time I killed myself. And then came back and I had to fight him again. And this time he died properly, so we're good. We tasty gems. So we're going this way. Bit of a bugger right to do it twice though. Animales. Del Monte. Oh no, this place is gonna blow up. We have to get out of here. Put those short legs to work, kid. Eight minutes. We got eight minutes to get out. That's not so bad. I think we can do that. Once we do that, we gotta wrap this fucking episode up. These guys are already gone. They are gone. Man, they just had faith that we'd win and just left. Like, ah, I'm sure he'll win. Let's just go. If he doesn't, let the guy will murder us. I can't move, I'm petrified, please help. Let's hop on the elevator with us. I, I can't, I have a phobia of electronics. You can't be for real. We need to carry you back the way we came from. Handy can take care of carrying him. I don't think we have time to discuss this. Please, I'll give you a special treasure return, please help me. It's up to you, kid. We can leave him behind and take the elevator back to safety, or take the long way back and save him. Let's go! Oh, thank you, thank you. All right, let's move it. Eight minutes is a while now, if we're going the whole way back. Even if we go all the way back, it's an elevator that brought us down this far. This long, this way. There's also an elevator way. It's a more industrial version of an elevator. God damn, we were getting so lucky there too. I'm willing to risk the health just to get out of here though. Let's go. Keep moving. I want to make sure we get out of here in time and save this monkey man. No, he's not a monkey man. He's a tribe, tribe, tribe guy, tribe guy. Fuck! That is not helping with getting through here quickly. We don't have time for all this fucking monkey and about. Come on, come on. Move. Go, go, go. Let's go, dude, go. Damn it. We just gotta keep going this way until we get to that elevator thing so we can get out of here. No! Fuck! That was a mistake. That was a big mistake. We came so far up. This one? I think. I don't even know. 
Ah, 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 fuck! Ah! What's the journal lighting up for? What does that mean? Fuck. Journal, help me out here. No? I don't know why you were lighting up then. Let's go. I feel like my jump's gotten less potent. But that would be crazy, right? I don't know where the elevator is, I really don't. Is this the way we're going? I hope so. We must be running- yeah, we're- We're so far out of time, I don't think we can make it. I wish we could. I really want to save this guy. I still see it happening. I see why it's designed the way it is though. For the backtrack, for the heading back. God. Cool. Keep going. Whoa. Move. Oh, we got this, we got this. It looks like we've managed to skip that other elevator altogether and we're just climbing all the way up somehow. We've got less than half our time left. So I hope we're fucking close. Good. And stop for nothing. Ladies and gents, you know what time it is? The oh, fuck, we don't have time for this. Can you wait until we're safe? That's right, it's time for the Puzzle Man Show. Seriously, bro? Right now, while we're escaping an exploding volcano? Okay. I think we're safe here at least. I hope we don't go back to a sea of lava. That's what I'm worried about. Alright. Come on, guys. I like how this is testing you on the how you well you've noticed the lore and stuff. Welcome back, folks! It's time for another amusing quiz show. Get some nachos, things are about to get spicy. The party is just getting started. Question 1. Why is El Celsarissimo inside Pika Pika Volcano? Oh fuck, I don't know. Oh, he's trapped. How do I keep learning this stuff without talking to anyone? I don't know. Correct. In order to ensure he doesn't escape the volcano, Stitches gave El Celsarissimo all the food he desired to gain his trust. But Stitches' ulterior motives would make him grow large and fat. All thanks to enhanced condiments designed by T. Burr. Embarrassed by his appearance, the Don simply refuses to show up in public anymore. And because of his gargantuan proportions, Don Solcerissimo can't escape his own spicy prison. What a fate! Is it just me or is it getting harder in here? Question 2. What substance is about to erupt from the volcano? Lava? Spicy salsa. That would be the obvious answer, but you're wrong. It is definitely hotter in here. Question three. Why did Don Solcerissimo agree to work with Stitches? I don't know these ones. Uh, he fears Stitches, it seems like. That's what it sounds like according to what they were saying. Correct. The simple answer is sometimes the the simplest answer is sometimes the correct answer, folks. Stitches lets him stay on this island as long as he continues to give him the profit of his operation and battle the heroes. El Salsarissimo would never try to disobey Stitches after what he did to the previous evil Queen of Darkness. Grizzly stuff, folks. Is that it? Only three questions this time. Congratulations, kiddo, you win money. I still got one wrong. First one was our only foolproof one. I'm afraid we'll have to cut the show short today, folks. Things are getting dangerously hot outside. But don't worry, dear contestants. I'll do you a solid and bring you back to a safe spot. How safe exactly? I wish you all the best and we'll see each other next time on The Puzzle Man Show.
This way we don't have to take what's his name on the Didn't have to take the guy on the fucking elevator. Oh thank you, thank you, I'll never forget this. Saving people feels good. Yeah, you're right. It's not just used to helping monsters. That's I'm just not just used to helping monsters, that's all. Yeah, wait, no. Erupting volcano, anyone? I'll return to the village soon. Take this as my thanks. See you later. Minus one stamina cost for the sword. That's pretty powerful, man. You are not running away, cockroaches. Oh boy, he's coming back and he doesn't sound happy. Did we beat him already? Do something, kid. I have a plan. Don't need to explain it, just go! <laughs> Handy said, I would left to accelerate, hold right to slow down. Jump on those bombs to slow down that salamander jerk. Boom. Dude, this is fun! Who the fuck would slow down? Why would I slow down? That'd be nuts. Hey! Boom! You'll never catch me now! You're too fast on a bit of wood. Boom! Damn it! That might cost me. How close is he? Boom! Here he is! That'll slow him down. Boom! Got him again! Holy balls, this course is getting gnarly, man! You'd think it'd be gnarlier at the top, not at the bottom. Nice. We're making some distance on him again. Oh shit, I jumped over it. My bad. That's gonna cost me as well. No way! We need to wrap this episode up. God damn. But it's all action all the time at the moment. All action all the time. Look at that sun in the background. It's so pretty. See you later. Boom. Thanks, Handy. You to Mandy. Handy, Handy, Mandy. God damn, I hit the lava. God damn! I missed the thingy! I can't see him though, so we must be doing alright. Going down! God damn, I missed another one! This could be bad! Shit, he's right there! Oh fuck, I missed another one! We can't afford to keep missing them like that, he's gonna murder us! Jesus Christ, how far down is this mountain? I'm getting sick of this now. Like, it's fun, but I feel like some of these, some of these bits overstay their welcome at times. Oh, good, it ended. As it was, as I was saying, it was overstaying its welcome. Hey, dude! I know! Not seawater, my delicate skin! Okay, everyone is looking at my lumps. I'm sensitive about that. I'm sorry, Stitchy, I'm out for you. <laughs> my lumps. My lumps, my lumps, my lumps. Once again, the day has been saved by self-consciousness. I thought you were supposed to give him his triviality stone. Ah, oh, drats. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. I believe we're strong enough to defeat Mr. Stitches now. Ahem. The champions return! Oh no. You have saved tribe! They tell us of your deeds, very heroic. And as promised, all monsters free now. Only those who truly want to fight can come to Colosseum when they want. 
Now it is time for winning. Whoa there, this kid is underage. Ah, oh, didn't notice. Mask and all. Thought maybe just small stature. Underage is unacceptable in our tribe. Very civilized coming from a wild tribe. Afraid we must eat you now that marriage is no more. I spoke too soon. Uh, how about we give you a magical stone? Magical how? Back me up, guys. You can control El Salsarissimo with this legendary stone. You'll have to do your bidding, yes. Oh, as leader of Pika Tribe, be accept. Give a kid. Remember, you can only use it if he's close or something. There is a catch always. The eating you part was a joke, of course. Yeah, sure it was. <laughs> sure it was. Asshole. Alright, let's go save up. We're going to wrap this episode up. In the next one, I guess we'll go back home. Sounds like we might be taking on Mr. Stitches. Which is pretty fucking intimidating. We'll just see what happens when we get there. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me, and I'll see you in the next one.